my friends, Lindsay Arnold here. I finally received my Ansi Labs package, which means I have my fidget cube waiting for me in this box. Um, I figured I'd document it since this was such a, there's my cat, point of contention with everyone on the Kickstarter campaign who's just been waiting for the fidget cube to finally arrive. I got my notification that they were shipping it uh, last week, and dun, 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 dun. let's see. Thank you for your order, placed on January 11th, 2017. I think I ordered it a lot sooner than that, but uh, anyway, so it's wrapped up in a bubble wrap. This bubble wrap kept your fidget cube safe on its journey to you. Take a moment to treat yourself and pop a few. Hashtag fidget fever. I can see that. Anyway, uh, let's get this thing open and finally fucking enjoy it. That's cute. So it, the official fidget cube from Anti Labs comes in one of these uh, cool by Anti Labs. So it says by Anti Labs directly on it. And let's see. Oh, okay, now there's a safety seal. So I'll get that off. And, oh, there's one on both sides. So make sure you do both of them. I ordered the white and green one, which is probably why it took forever to arrive. Because I was a December backer. And I, I don't know how to open it. Oh, there we go. All right. Um, it's pretty sealed. We found ourselves clicking a pen, shaking our knee, or tapping our fingers during meetings or in class. Fidgeting is totally normal behavior, often accompanying moments of productivity, concentration, and brainstorming. We designed the fidget cube as a tool to satisfy the natural urge to fidget through the day. Ansi Labs, ansilabs.com, and for the record, this is a choke. How the fuck do you get this off without breaking it? It is like taped pretty well on the bottom of this, and now there's some sticky ish. That uh, comes off pretty easily, but as you can, maybe I should turn this light on. Does that help? No. It's so bright. All right, so back here. As you can see, all right, so first off, I have ordered an imposter fidget cube. Um, feels very similar, except the clickiness of the buttons are a little different, specifically the ones that you go like this. Um, they click a little different. The joysticks are a little lower on the action. Um, this thing turns, and it does say fidget cube on it, like in there. Um, these buttons click a little better. I'm not going to say overwhelmingly that the fidget cube is a much better product than the imposter that I have, but the clickiness of these is definitely better. I kind of like the joystick of the other one better, not going to lie, and this does not really turn as well. I don't know. By the time you're done playing with it, you're probably sick of it pretty quickly, I've found. Um, I've also gotten used to the imposter. Um, I don't know. I think if you ordered some of the fake ones, you might not be so disappointed once you finally get the real one. I mean, you might not be. I don't know. It's cool. I like it. Now I got two. So there you have it. Enjoy.